Tony Awards, you missed a very big night for the University of Michigan. Gavin Creel, 1998 alum of the School of Music, Theater and Dance, won the Tony for Featured Actor. And as Nick Monticelli reports, he dedicated the theater world's biggest award to his alma mater. No, not on. This one is, though. All right, so here on one of the stages at the University of Michigan, I talked to Gavin personally and his very first vocal coach here. And after both of those conversations, you get a very good understanding of why he wanted to mention the university specifically. With the little peninsula, it seats about 125. School is out for the summer, but the students touring U of M's School for Music, Theater, and Dance knew all about last night's Tony. Can you imagine? I mean, it's the buzz of the university at the moment, so it's pretty cool. Mal Racine is an associate dean at the school and was Gavin Creel's vocal coach. From the moment I heard that voice, I knew, I knew that he would do wonderful things with it. Yay. The two are very close to this day. In fact, she still has him on speed dial or FaceTime speed dial, if that's a thing. My dog is eating leaves behind me. Wally, you want to say hi? Say hi at Channel 4. Bye. From a park in New York City, Gavin says winning the Tony last night was surreal. And the Tony goes to Gavin Creel. He won for featured actor and a musical for his role in Bette Midler's Hello, Dolly and is making the headlines today for his shout out to U of M. But I want to dedicate this, oh my goodness, to the musical theater department at the University of Michigan School of Music, Theater and Dance. My education there as a young person changed my life forever. Acknowledging Michigan and my professors and my classmates was the most important thing to me. So exactly how much influence did the program have on Creel? He says it was everything. I guess best way to put it, I had very little education in the arts and, and performing, and my head was sort of split open with knowledge once I got to Michigan. <laughs> to see them um, successful in the traditional sense, but also in the bigger sense, um, it doesn't get better than that. Thank you. At U of M, so much. Nick Monticelli, Local 4. But wait, there's more. Two other U of M alums, Bench Pasek and Justin Paul, they won Tony's for best score writing. Creel was able to attend U of M because of a scholarship, and he urges those who can to consider donating so that other students can have the same opportunity. Go Blue.